last time we went off, I had to use Google to to uh, figure out animorphs. And we're going to activate the memento. So we're going to the palace. Hey. We're actually in teens, maybe? Aww. Everybody's leaving already. But I just got here. <laughs> Seems to happen to you a lot at parties. Oh, go shave your child's jobs for the insecure. <laughs> This guy look no, I wanna see the wizard. Let me see the wizard. Yay! Uh, no, he's not. That guy look uh, where's he? Yeah. Him. He looks like a wizard. Meh. Well there's nothing at the party. Let's follow the path. This place is still lovely even without a house. Ah, oh, there's the lovely couple. Right. Requires two bars of memory links to proceed. Well, I guess we've just got to walk around. A bush! It stops me from walking! Ah, uh, the jar of pickles. Or olives, even. A glass bottle of pickled olives. I see Le Fromage, but where's the mouse? Or moose? That's the Cornish remark you've made all night. Don't you mean cheesiest remark? Wow. <laughs> An aged animal book. Well, we've got two, so I guess we can go into the lighthouse now. To the lighthouse we go. Oh no, he's not old now, so I can't put an old man voice on. Now that we got rings on, I mean. No. Why? Do you? Actually, yeah, I think I do. What is it like? It's just different. So I guess they've just got married. Just the responsibilities, I suppose. Responsibilities. Do you like the name Anya? Would you like to name her Anya? I, I understand. is a good name for her. Hey, come with me. Trip and fall. How can you trip and fall while dancing? Oh, yeah, dancing even. Don't, don't worry. Just follow my steps. I've never, I've never been good at dancing. Ah, I'm rubbish. <laughs> Ow, my ass! 
I think you stepped on my toes. Sorry. Come on, let's try again. Oh, that just ruined the moment. Uh, and then they danced until the sun rose. Ain't that sweet? Such a lovely couple. Promise to love and comfort to honor and keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. I do. And do you take this man standing before you to be your lawfully wedded husband? To promise to love and comfort to honor and keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. The power invested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to, I present you Mr. and Mrs. Wiles. Oh, we got to see the wedding! Yay! I'm so happy for them. Back the wedding. Uh, yeah. What did you think that was? You know, I'm just bad at weddings, that's all. Fluids tend to escape from my eyes. I didn't know you were that sentimental. Oh, did I say my eyes? I meant my mouth. <laughs> and by fluids, I meant both fluids and solids. <laughs> that's a lovely image. Thanks, Neo. Come, let's find a way to get out of here. All this happiness and joy is really putting you off, too, huh? No, I just don't like watching people make mistakes. Sheesh, whatever happened to you, just take it moment by moment. Can I talk to them? Nope. Aww. You look spiffing in a tux, Johnny. Absolutely spiffing. Well, I guess this is the... Uh, Wedding party. Can I talk to them? Yay! Oh, well, I'd better go see how your aunt is doing. Alright, Ma, tell her thanks for coming. I will. How can he not remember what his mum looks like? She's all fuzzy. I'm so proud of you, Joey. Joey? Oh, that's my grandpa's name. He passed away before I was born. Ma calls me by it, it calls me by it as an as my nickname. How come you never told me about it? Cause I'd rather you call me John. Uh, I'd feel the same way. <laughs> Not another sentimental grandparent childhood. What do you have against those anyway? I mean, you sure talk about your grandfather all that. What? No, I don't. Whatever you say. Receive note, Joey. Do you have anything to say? Nope. Well, the party's a bit empty, so... Let's just check south. Mm, well, our car's here. Joey, don't be in the middle of the road. That's how people get run over. It's even... Oh, wait, there's a rabbit. Can't be helped, River. I'm sure they didn't mean to. Come on, we're late. Wait, is that a rabbit? Think this is the source of all those folded paper ones? Why would, why would she be so obsessed over some roadkill? Not to mention so many years later. Don't ask me. You are the woman here. I'll be convinced that I'm the only one when you do a cordless bungee jump. <laughs> Damn them mean to each other. Ah, come on, we're, we're late. Hey, there it is. Note, dead rabbit. Kaboom! Actually, while we're here, let's have a look at these now. Where? What items have we got? Bone on it, room key, toy platypus, paper rabbit. 
Dr. Eve Rosaline, Senior Memory Traversal Agent, Sigmund Corp. Ten, uh, Dr. Neil Watts, Technic, uh, Technician Specialist, Sigmund Corp. Let's have a look at the notes. We haven't actually read any of these yet. Dead Robert, a rogue kill on Johnny and River's wedding. Anya, abandoned light house by the cliffside. Clock, the clocks in Johnny's house never tick. Moon, objective. The moon is uh, Johnny's memory is full. Uh, pickled olives, Johnny's favorite. Pickle rabbit, what whoever gave to John. Acrophobia, something that Johnny and River apparently didn't have. So they're not afraid of heights. Animals, Johnny's favorite childhood books. Joey, Johnny's nickname named after his grandfather. Okay. We're off. Well, I gotta do this first, then it'll probably take me a good chunk again. No, this one's easy. I am a genius. I am a genius. Yeah. Yay, yay. Off we go. To the past. You know, it's a fantastic wedding when the mementos are roadkill. <laughs> hey. Maybe she saw it as a metaphor for the terrible marriage. So years later, she began folding the rubbish because she was reminded of how rotten it was. Or, you know, something e equally pretentious. Cool story, Neil. Needs more dragons. So we get to see it get... So how much earlier is this? How long has that rabbit been on the road? Poor thing. What's with all the road kills today? Don't, <laughs> don't you look at me like that. It smells like a farm. And roadkill. Deactivate the sun sim simulator or get away from here already. Here we're contacting Neil for a change. Uh, no, I guess it's empty that side. Go right then. So how long has that rabbit been dead there? <sighs> oh, a bus! <laughs> Never mind. Because <laughs> we can't get killed by a bus. There's a horse. Whoa! Don't do it. Don't do what? It's blue. You know what? Don't not ride this horse. What are you, five years old? Okay, I won't not ride it. <laughs> yeah! Quit wasting time, Neil. Oh crap! That can't be good. Neil, you're riding it backwards. Don't just stand there. Help me! Damn it, this was not in the job description. Receive Dr. Neil. <laughs> Receive no Dr. Neil Watts. Let's have a look at what that note was. I thought it'd be something like he was an idiot. Village idiot. I'm right. <laughs> uh Neil, you are too awesome. Uh, let's go and chase him. Ooh, there's a hut. Ah. Is that really a good idea? She should be okay. She's not new to this anymore. But she's never done it by herself before. I'll be fine. I'm not a child. Ah! <laughs> River! Oh no. Oh no, she's alright. She's smiling! Why why is the horse got blue hair? Yeah, roll with it. What's the matter? Let's go. Oh she's so happy. Hey, wait up! Uh, I wonder if Neil got off that horse yet. Eva! That's like you use your wallet. Eva! This is about 90% more than I can handle. What a moron. Oh, no, well Neil, you're not gonna be able to join him. Yeah, but the horse! I'm on a horse! This horse is amazing! Oh, wow! Yeah! Woo! I'm on a horse! Oh. <laughs> Thanks! I sort of knocked off Neil. 
Ow. Come on. Catch up to them. Where'd they go? There they go. Catch up, catch up. No. say we've taken the horse with us. Please say we've taken the horse. Is the Darren no shirt on? Yes, we've reached a consensus on the result. I guess we're in a hospital? A clinic? Unfortunately, like many cases of pervasive de uh, development disorders, this is rather late diagnosis. Had you known when you were a child, miss, it could have saved you a lot of trouble. Do you have any books about it? The, this one is by Tony Atwood. He's one of the specialists on the subject. You can borrow it for free of charge for now. Just don't elope with it. Thanks, Doc. Now, are you two a couple? Unmarried and without any of her current legal aff affiliations? Yes, I see. Well, I could give you a referral to a speci specialized counselor if you wish. Is there anything unsettling in the relationship? No. And you, sir? No, it's fine. Nonetheless, sir, you should also give the book a read. It'll help you understand the condition. I'd rather not. Why is that? Well, it's your call. In that meantime, there's a thing called equine therapy that might help her. I guess that's the horse riding. A ranch just not up there, just north of here, offers it. I can contact them for you. Ah, oh, there's two of them. Well, two of each. Told you so. Well, I'm actually going to save it here. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed. And that horse riding was amazing. Anyway, see you on the next episode. Bye-bye.